Hello everyone, Kirby Volt here, and welcome back to Let's Play Bastion Blind. On the last episode, we went out to another place to get a crystal shard, and we fought the mysterious, monstrous Queen Anne, and then we kind of just left. I didn't want to leave, but we left. And then we did a uh, Proving Grounds with the pistols. And now, we're off to do more stuff, but before... It's been a while since I recorded... Uh, yeah. Let's upgrade the pistols. Oh. Well, never mind. Also, I'm pretty sure I mentioned this last time, but people told me, yeah, you can just switch between these two. This is just one upgrade tier. These two are... It's just which one do you prefer. And I do prefer the left side. I think I said that. I don't remember. I meant to do that. Clearly, I did. Hey, Carl. What's up? Uh, come on. Give the little tiger a break. What, what do you mean? I didn't do anything bad to Carl. Wait, where's Zia? Did did Zia run off? No, okay, she's right there. Thank goodness. Anyways, I'd love to upgrade those pistols, but we don't have enough materials. So, off we go. To the scrapyard? What were we doing there? We have the Point La Main. Hmm. I want to go to the musket one. <laughs> Let's just find out what happens. This is a great. This is a great plan. It is not going to have any repercussions whatsoever. Like picking up broken glass barehanded. As Oldwood Grove marshals learn to make every shot count. Okay. So what do we do? We just destroy all targets in a few shots. Pop all those nasty gourds without wasting ammo. Okay. Boom. Most marshals didn't get Boom. far on the first few tries. Boom. Ah, freak. Boom. Oh, why was this one not going away? What? Go away. There we go. Get you down there. Get, you're gonna get off. Just I forget you. You guys can go away. You can go away. I am doing terrible. As what? The musket makes no sense. Had to catch a bunch of those boards in a single shot. That's what I'm trying to do, Rux. I know what I'm doing. Funny thing about muskets is they work best up close. Okay, well I didn't know that. Alright, thank you. Until they those muskets. Did I at least get something? I did, I got. Something coarse, so I got upgrade material for the musket. That's not too bad, all things considered. So I'm okay with that. Oh, next one's only 22. Okay, so I didn't do terrible. Just not great. Marshals did more than just stand around shooting, of course. I'm sure they did. What's... Oh, well, we have a mailbox. I have a mailbox. Still no mail. Go figure. Oh, okay. It's night time, so we'll be quiet. All right. Well, if they're not going to give me materials. The only reason I want to go to them is to get materials. That's Trapper Shingle, only place in the city to go to get certified with a repeater. Let's go get certified with my weapon of choice. I've heard that this proving grounds is terrible, but no place better than Trapper Shingle for learning to tread light and shoot straight. We'll find Trappers out. Have to tread real careful here, else take a nasty fall. Uh, okay. They train themselves by clearing out the targets, while not clearing out the floor. Okay, this isn't too bad. Any good trapper knows never to take a step till the time is right. This one isn't that bad. I'm going to regret saying that in probably like a few seconds here, I'm sure. But I have upgraded the repeater to have quite a bit of ammo, so... I mean, I can tell what the problem is going up to be, but... So far, things are pretty decent. Okay, now they're getting a bit tense. Now they're getting to be a problem. Okay, that's it. Expert trappers got something extra to give them an edge. I mean, that wasn't bad. Oh, we get we get more upgrade for the pistol. Sweet. 
Next prize. So we almost... I almost did it. I just need to be a bit more careful. So that was... I don't think that was that bad. I'm not going to be perfect at these, obviously, but I don't think that was that terrible. Think a rickety place like the shingle survived, and so little else did. All right. So, is there any ch by chance we've got more materials at all? Because that would be lovely. No. And no. Fifty percent damage, improved firing rate. Oh, wider attack spread. Uh, guess we need to go and. Play the game. How much do you guys get materials? The hanging gardens. Folks used to go here to relax from their relaxing. Good for them. Wait, oh that's that's for the Oh yeah, because we got we got that. We got the spear. That I believe I promptly threw away because I went this thing is annoying. Because I like the hammer. So there you go. Know how Ceylandia became the richest city in the world? I do not. Two words. Point Lemain. Two words. If the wilds could ever be tamed, it was gonna happen right here. Two words, I am retired. But now, the greatest outpost past the city line is nothing but a freak show. Well, good for them. I hope they enjoyed season the three of... Triggers once had the place on lockdown. I hope they... Well, what is that? An army carbine? I just get a freaking sniper now. Pick up where they left off. Blam. Just like my fighting days. Gun like that can even put the wilds in check. Cool. I want my repeater back, but cool. I can see it's many... I can see it's use. I just would prefer the repeater. Days for sure, but it ain't done. Okay, no thank you. Oh yeah, and because I'm not using the repeater... Hi. Don't do that. What did I pick up? Uh, oh, I completed something. With... Oh! Cool! The Grand Rail of Point the Main. Not only is it still there, it still works. All right, and we have now an auto scroller. This is the first. Okay, I really miss my repeater now. Yeah. You could say that again, Rux. You could say that again. Okay, well, this is worthless. I really do not like this weapon. <laughs> uh, Grand rails all grown over with things of calamity chewed up and spat out. Things eager to take back their turf. Okay, it's powerful. But You know me and the repeater. I mean that's the old song and dance, me and the repeater. We go we go back a ways. Okay, I'm just gonna take materials, get hit a lot, a by. not care that I'm not letting things die, but I... This rifle is so dumb. Lunkhead settled in like they own the place. Yes, they did. And I settle in on them like I own them, because I'm going to mount your hide on a wall. Goodbye. Can I get an arsenal, please, to get rid of this? Because I really want to repeat back. I'd even take the dueling pistols, even though they're not as great as they probably could be yet. I'd really prefer one of those. What is that? Uh, well, not that way. Hi! No. We're not playing that game. Goodbye. I'm playing the counter game, though. Countering is fun. What is that? This thing's so weird, because it's auto-locking on the stuff that I can't see. I do not care for that. One bit. So... Without any further ado, can we please just... Ah, there we go. Works for me. 
Why do they fall and explode? I mean, it's cool that it essentially is almost a one-hit kill when you line up the crosshairs, but other than that, it's like, it's a very slow weapon that I don't think is that worth it. Closed off, but now it's split open like a rotten pineapple. I do like this area, though. This area looks really cool. Course the Grand Rail. Thank you! Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm now, I don't want to go back in there. Alright, let's take care of things proper this time. First shots fired in the Ura Ceylonian War. We should be paying more attention to what Rux is talking about, because he's actually talking about cool and important stuff, and I've been busy going, wow, this sniper is dumb. It was right here that Zolf's Ura forefathers decided to mix it up. Okay. And then what happens? Find out next time on Dragon Ball Z. No, bye! Kind of wanted those. Oops. Oh, hello. Goodbye. No, oh, almost goodbye. And luckily, I have plenty of okay, tonics. So maybe we didn't get their sign off on the whole Grand Rail thing. Oh, well. That was bad. Yeah, no, no crap. Probably shouldn't have done that, Rux. I mean, that may have not been you who is in charge of it, but probably shouldn't have. The rail must have shook the Ura to the bone down in those dens of theirs. And I do not like the Lunkheads. Except I like them when these guys kill them, because that's nice. <laughs> Anyways, there's our shard. Well, the rail won't last much longer now that the kid took the shard. Yep. It's still got one good run in store for him. All the rotten wood there on the rails turned it into swamp weed central. Yep. I don't want to get touched by much of this poison. We know what happened when we touch too much of this poison. Never tried dancing side to side while holding your breath. No, but I'll try that sometime. Sounds interesting. While we're choking on the swamp. Okay, may I, I'm not going to try that. I don't suggest anyone else tries that either. You in the eye. Well, let me tell you. You don't say! Oh, and these guys are back. Yeah, oh man. It is so much to have it's so nice having the repeater back. I missed you, repeater friends. You are you are my best friend, my BFF. Okay, hammer's great too, but. I'm excited to replace you though when I get the pistols to be up to the standard that I would like them to be at. Oh, something fancy. Go away, I needed to look at this fancy thing. An upgrade material for the Army Carbine! Okay, we know we're not going to be using it whatsoever. A clockwork organizer, once used for work and recreation. These springs and sprockets could be put to a better use. Oh, I love that word, sprocket. Sprocket, such a cool word. Not sure if any of you watch, like, the Jetsons. It's a very old show, but... Spacely sprockets? It's... But then, at last, it's the end of the line. They'll be picking swamp weed out of those boots for days. Yep, and it'll probably still be poisonous. Just the word sprocket. It's just a fun sounding word. English language is crazy. You get these cool words Turns like got company up at the rail station waiting for oh. oh the Wells Fargo wagon is going to kill me. Oh, a boss? At first he thinks it's Zolf. Uh turns out he's wrong. Is it a zombie? I don't want to go talk to this guy. Hello! This is for you, says the man. Then wham. Thanks for knocking me out. When the kid comes to, the man's long gone. But something else is there. The only words the kid recognizes on that parchment are for Zia. All right, we got a sealed note. Memento, a letter addressed to Zia. It appears to be written by Zolf, who must have found another Ura survivor to deliver the message. Maybe Zolf taught Zia enough of the native language to be able to read this. Okay, so is Zolf not a bad guy? I'm not sure what's going on anymore. 
Well, what's a kid to do? I can't attack anything. I can just walk slowly back. He took the shot. He took the hit. And he took that note. I do like a lot of Rux's dialogue. That note cuts straight to the heart of things, don't it? Well, let's not ponder on what it says. Let's go ask you for what it says. Zolf's messenger was one of his people. Wonder just how many of them survived, and what exactly Zolf told him. If I thought you could translate, whatever. Okay, Zia. Let's hope this doesn't end in tragedy. Oh, we got a ceramic stack pot. I I don't know, but finding gourmet ingredients ain't easy these days. But we'll take what we can get. Okie dokes. Anywho, the main thing we're here about is this. The note says it plain. Zia. Go east to learn the truth about the calamity and our people. I'll be waiting. Sincerely, Zulf. Oh, okay. Well, that sounds nice. That sounds dangerous. Don't do it. Thank you all very much for watching this episode of Let's Play Bastion Blind. If you like this uh, video, please consider hitting that like button below. And if you want to see more content from me, please consider subscribing. I hope you're having a great day, and I will see you in the next one. Until then, ciao.